Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. It's supposed to be a love reading. We're going to see what comes up. You know, I don't make shit up, so we're just going to see what happens. Um, this is the second reading. I just did one. Um, I tried to do one anyway. Uh, I got interrupted multiple times, one right after another. My phone was going nuts nuts and it has been very quiet for days my phone has been quiet i shit you not i started your reading and boom boom, 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 boom. i don't even know it was and it was like three one two three different people okay so it was just like oh my god so anyway i actually had to hit pause to i had to i had to because one of them was just whatever unexpected so anyway so i hit pause to answer it and uh um, then I had to go. So I, st I, I finished the reading and I had to get up and go. So take that as a message. Everything that happens during a reading is for you. Okay. Um, you may, and it, and it's funny because right here we had the eight of pentacles reversed and that's at work. Okay. And I was at work. Okay. So, and, and here we had the thinking woman reversed. So it's like you, something you're not thinking about. So, so you're not thinking um, this is going to happen, but it happens. Okay. So just, just keep that in mind. Um, so anyway, um, I had to get up and go. I had to, I had to go. So, uh, you are, may be at work. You may be at work and you get some sort of phone call and you have to get up and go. You just, you have to go. You have to leave. It's just the way it goes. Um, you're probably going to get multiple, uh, messages from people. Maybe somebody you didn't expect. Okay. Right here, we had the Wheel of Fortune reverse, the very first card. So that is uh, setbacks. Here we had the Page of Wands reverse, which is another setback. So you guys will be experiencing a setback. And that's the way it goes, okay? I'm sorry. Um, so when you get the Wheel of Fortune reversed, it's like your, the past coming back to haunt you. Past mistakes coming back to haunt you. It's bad luck. The Wheel of Fortune is a card of karma and destiny. It happens to be reversed. There could be some karma, and it could go all the way back to a past life that is coming back around. It doesn't have to be in this lifetime, okay? Um, so uh, that's your past coming back to haunt you. Okay, so and underneath that we had the six of cups reverse, which is about the past and but the six of cups reverse is some sort of abuse. Okay, and being relieved of obligations, packing up, leaving home, somebody may be leaving home. It's also nothing stays the same with the wheel of fortune and the six of cups. So something is about to change for you. I think it's going to you're going to be interrupted. You're going to be at work or you're going to be doing a workout or you're going to be at school or who knows. You're going to be doing something that you are engaged in and you're going to get interrupted. And it, it's going to be an interruption where you have to get up and you have to go. Okay? And when you also when you get the wheel of fortune reversed, it can be a shocking unpredictable horrendous loss and i'm sorry to say that okay i'm not trying to scare anybody and i'm not saying it because i don't like pisces because i actually really like pisces okay so let's see what we got here um i actually my i actually have more respect for pisces than i did put it that way um a lot more respect um, something has happened that has made me regain respect for my ex. Just so you all know. Um, he has, uh, done something that has changed my perceptive, my perception of him. In a good way. So what do we got for Pisces? Rest and rejuvenation. So this is time out, break time. You could call this the Four of Swords. Okay. Uh, it's very much like the Four of Swords. It's time for a break. It's time to heal. It's time to recuperate. Maybe you need to go within and be by yourself for a little while. Um, you may have been through something that was very exhausting. Maybe you were in a situation that wasn't um, in alignment with your soul. And now you need to heal. 
So I do feel like if this is a healing period for you. Maybe if you're, if maybe if you are just getting out of a relationship and and uh, or you're about to get out of a relationship, because down here in the last spread we had the two of cups reversed. So that is a split. Okay, that's a split. That's a that's a breakup. That's a separation. Damn it! That goddamn phone is ringing again. Unbelievable. Anyway, um, excuse my language. Anyway, there's some sort of split. There's some sort of, uh, breakup of some sort or argument. Okay. There's a disconnection in a union, um, incompatibility, an unhappy couple, an argument, a breakup of some sort. So if there has been, then you're going to need time to rest and rejuvenate. And it may come as a shock because remember that we'll, there could be a shocking split a shocking breakup what do we have for Pisces seven of coins reverse last time it was the eight of coins right here so this is seven this is unrealistic unsatisf dissatisfying situation there's no growth there's no need to invest in this anymore um, somebody hasn't been nurturing. They haven't been taking care of a situation. It's like it's going downhill. Something has died. The interest has died. And because there's been a lack of investment, okay, somebody didn't take care of things. Six of coins reversed, that's a rejection or a loss. Now, the six of pentacles reversed is becoming unemployed or becoming fired. This is strong control. This is fraud. This is not seeking professional advice. This is an abuse of, of power. Somebody that really wants to dominate. Somebody that is greedy. This is an injustice. This is somebody who uh, was offering something but with strings attached Okay, this is abuse of generosity or an abuse of power. Um, King of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. You, it doesn't have to be. This is somebody that is very controlling and manipulative. Very manipulative. This is somebody is the, who is very much uh, dominating. Very much wants to be the boss in control. Now, this could be the Pisces male. It could be Pisces female. This is somebody who likes to be in control, who wants to be the boss. This could be the owner of a company. This is uh, an entrepreneur or, you know, this could be the president. This is somebody that is an authority. This could also be a judge. Uh, the King of Pentacles is given to take action because he wants to be in control. Ringing Again, my phone is ringing again. I'm telling you why. Anyway, there's going to be, you're going to be receiving a lot of phone calls. No doubt about it. My phone is quiet 90% of the time. Very quiet. So, uh, this is action being taken. Um, this is a loss. This is. The Six of Coins is a loss. Somebody abused their power. They did. This is going within. So we definitely have somebody that needs a time out to go within to heal from a situation. I mean, this is the Hermit. The Hermit is a time of reflection, a time of introspection, a time of spiritual awakening through solitude. So you really need to be alone. You really need to be alone. I think you've been in a situation, whether if you were the male or the female, somebody has been in a very dominating situation and they definitely need time to heal. This is healing and this is healing. So it's a healing period. Four of Cups reversed. Here's that Eight of Coins. So that is putting in effort. Looking forward now. It's time to look forward. I think that you guys need to take a break. You definitely need... And maybe you need to go by yourself somewhere and get away from this situation. You need to stop giving your energy to something. 
It's, I feel as though, you know, you need to put effort into you right now. It's all about you. You need to take care of you. And, and maybe you need to regain structure in your life. You need to retake back control of your life. I do, there's definitely some sort of loss with that six of, six of coins reverse. There's been a, a lack of, of reciprocation. Somebody's been a, in a one-sided situation with somebody that was very controlling. And now it's time to definitely heal. Definitely. Um, put effort into you. This is going south, something going downhill fast. That the ace of it looks well, if you move the number, it looks like the ace of wands going downhill fast. This is actually the six of wands. This is lack of success. Somebody wasn't making progress. Um probably fighting a losing battle, you know. definitely headed in the wrong direction because both of these sixes are reversed sixes are the journey to balance and harmony they're both reversed somebody was very materialistically focused definitely focused on materials focused on possessions and I feel like um, there could be a loss of, of money or a loss of assets or a loss of money from a partner because this maybe this person is leaving I do see solitude. I see you being alone. Okay, this is right in the middle. This is going to be in the middle. Okay, the hermit. This is being alone. Go with it within. Going within. Withdrawing from others. Completely going within. Realizing your true identity. Becoming who you are meant to be at this time in your life. It's like a time of evolution. Maybe you're d deciding not to give your energy to other people. It's time of reflection right now. You know, you, you may you may not be ready for any new battles. You've already been through a battle. You just need time alone to get. It feels like this is almost like post traumatic stress to get over this stressful situation. Um, Page of Cups. Now this is an offer of love. This is also um, you may have an admirer of some sort. Pisces, somebody or somebody that you admire. Ooh, we could have something to do with children here as well. This is a child, and this is a child. Doesn't have to be, but you may, you may. This could be a father, a father, and there could be problems with the children, or there's issues with the children. Doesn't I don't know. Could be a husband that has issues with the children, or you have issues with their children. Something to do with children here. But this is a message you don't want to hear. The page of swords in reverse is is a conflict. Somebody may have stuck their nose in where they shouldn't have, and they may have said something that really really hurts. This is somebody that plays mind games. Somebody has been playing mind games using emotions as like emotionally blackmailing another person. Seriously, emotional blackmail right here. Somebody has been in a hostile situation which they are retreating from. This is a retreat. This is the birth of a new life. This, this is giving birth after a painful situation. The Empress is loving and tender and kind and generous. She has a lot of life experience. She's been through a very painful experience. And she's receiving a blessing of some sort. Um, it's a very fertile time. It's, time. it's a time of growth. It's time to develop your new beginning it's time it's like this is like a gestational period where you are becoming a new person that's what this is this is you uh, g going through that period of well that what is it conception whatever it is of developing the new person that you are about to be um we also have something to do with a mother here or maybe it's the mother of your children or maybe it's protecting a mother <laughs> that could be it that could be it this person is a good mother anyhow um, this is becoming aware 
becoming aware becoming aware of of love begin becoming a, aware of of something i mean this is love i feel pisces as if you are the pisces and you are single if you are pisces and you are single you probably have an admirer you probably have an admirer who is very is crushing on you they may want to they may be flirting with you they may want to communicate with you um this person may have children may have children this person um is beautiful this person is a caregiver this person is could be taurus could be libra doesn't have to be um but this is a lack of progress being made in an in an unrequited love situation there's no progress being made this is putting in effort to move forward now look forward so i think you guys are going to need time to heal and go within and become aware of of that now it's time for your new life you do have a new life here that is about to begin you do and there will be love there will be love but you need to uh invest in you this is a time of self-investment for you so that you can be emotionally available for love that's what this is the empress is the queen of all queens she is the and she deals with the pain alone because there isn't nobody that can deal with that pain And it hurts. Anyway, I feel as though you, if you are the female watching this, whether you are the cross watcher or whoever, if you are the female watching this, the pain that you have endured is going to bring you a blessing because when you give birth to that pain, you receive a blessing. But you have to face it and you have to deal with it to get your blessing. No matter how much it hurts. So if you are the female, be prepared to receive some sort of blessing. For enduring the pain that you have been put through. If you are the masculine, the man watching this. This is you needing to take control. This is you needing to take action. And open your heart to this beautiful woman. Because this woman knows her value and knows her worth she doesn't chase anybody she's learned from life experience if you want me you have to come and get me i'm not coming to get you that's who she is she knows her value she knows her worth and everybody sees her beauty They see her worth. They see her worth because she sees her worth. That's the energy she puts out. She's, she's, she's beautiful. She's glowing. She's bright. She's blossoming. Everybody can see it from a freaking mile away. She has gentle grace. So she's about to receive a blessing. Somebody could even get pregnant during this month. Just saying there could be a pregnancy. Just just saying. Um, anyway, Pisces, I feel like it is time for you to reflect. It is time for you to go within. And plan. This is planning your next move. There is something that is dying. That did not grow. That cannot grow anymore. It's dead. And now it's time to look forward. And focus on the future. Put effort into yourself. As this new life is beginning. Because you are about to begin a new life. That's what we have here. And it really is beautiful. It really, really is. You may feel like you're never going to... Uh, have victory you may feel like you're never going to be successful you may feel like you're always going to be alone but i don't see that 
You have to take action. You have to take control. You have to act with nobility. And you have to open your heart to somebody that is worthy. But you have to be worthy yourself. And you ha this is you have to go through a healing period first. So this is a healing period for you. And that's what I got. Good luck.